Welcome to the Applied Research Associates YouTube channel. This channel is designed to provide both information and perspective on challenges and perspectives in and around both physical and cybersecurity and to educate you on ARA's complete suite of services around one of the major drivers of policy in the federal sector, the Interagency Security Committee, or ISC. Our topic today is the Design Basis Threat, or DBT. The Design Basis Threat is the core of the risk assessment portion of the ISC risk management process. The Design Basis Threat Report, included in the core documentation of the risk management process for federal facilities, Appendix B, establishes a profile of the type, composition, and capabilities of potential adversaries. It is an estimate of the overall threat facing federal facilities nationally across a range of undesirable events. It includes intelligence information, reports, assessments, and the most current crime statistics available. Now, the Design Basis Threat Report is reviewed and updated annually to ensure that the most current information is being presented. The Design Basis Threat Report offers enough information that, should you need to assess risk for a facility that you have not yet conducted an on-site visit yet, you can pull enough information from the Design Basis Threat Report to complete a risk assessment based on your evaluation of national level information. Applying the Design Basis Threat Report to your facility can be challenging. While the DBT in and of itself is sufficient to support a national level ISC risk assessment, that is really only the initial step. The ARA training program is the only training program that is being offered today where you will be taught a specific how-to process to evaluate and calculate a facility-specific local value for threat, vulnerability, and consequence, supplementing the national information available in the Design Basis Threat Report. To fully assess the true specific local value of risk, you need this class. The ARA process meets all the criteria to be credible, reproducible and defensible, and is based on national standards such as HSPD-7, PPD-21, the National Infrastructure Protection Plan, or the NIP, and the ISD standards themselves. ARA has been in the business of risk assessments for over 20 years and has successfully completed hundreds of ISC-compliant risk assessments for virtually every major federal agency. ARA's training programs give real-world examples of how we use the risk management process to evaluate federal facilities and develop real solutions that meet the ISC's mission of safe and secure in federal facilities. Let ARA's experience help you navigate your risk assessment path using the Design Basis Threat Report by attending one of our risk management process classroom sessions or one of our convenient webinars. We can help. Our next video segment will discuss facility security levels, and we hope you'll join us. For more information, visit us at www.ara.com slash ISC or contact us at isc at ara.com. Thank you.